<laughs> Only God can save me. <laughs> Eventually. Nobody is not there again. Eventually. <laughs> Hi everyone, my name is Jamel Dondada. Welcome to Talk Liberia. If you are new here, all you have to do is to follow us on YouTube and Facebook. Follow us on YouTube, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more videos. One love, one love. Happy July 26 to all Liberians. Thank you for your time. Yes, hello. Uh, my name is Jamel Dondada. Welcome to Talk Liberia. Uh, my name is Greatness M. Kali, but for sure you call me Daylight Witness. Daylight Witness. Okay, we want to know, do you think Liberia is actually for Liberians? Yeah, 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 yeah. But you, 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 say, you see the thing, they say Liberians. So you belong in Liberia now? <laughs> <laughs> so because they say Liberians, so it means that Liberia is for Liberians? You, 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 you belong to Liberia. But, all right. How do you feel about the situation in Liberia where majority of the big businesses are owned by foreigners and Liberians are selling without market? Yeah, as for me, my own uh, part to play in that, Liberians are not serious. Hey. Liberians are not serious. Most of them, they are not serious at all. You will see learning men selling in shop. Labrador men working under the mayor. They not get sense. Okay, okay. Continue. That is all to have their own era. That the problem that they maybe I don't know what really happened to Liberians. As for me, I can work on a foreigner. Yes. So you say Liberians are not serious? No, some of them are not serious. All right. Do you think Labrador is poor to the extent that she cannot provide for her citizen? Labrador is very, very poor. Poor indeed. Poor. Po, po I ain't not a gonna po, po. Seriously, po. <laughs> yes. Okay. Why you think Liberians are suffering in their own country? Yeah, no, because no good role in the country. Yeah, right now, you see the whole road to go all the way. It's very, very bad. To go all the way, Bapuru, you suffer. At least for that side to go on that side way, they face that side, but now, no good roads. In the schools, sometimes you can get schools, churches, mosques, but actually, no good roads in the country. All right, some people say the youth of Liberia are very lazy. Is that true? <laughs> well, for me, I can say it too, I can say it loud, but for me, I'm strong. I have to live for my own money. Yes, I can live for my own money. I sustain myself, but I know for others. All right, so tell me, what do you see happening for the youth of Liberia? Oh, uh, so many, many are going way war. When I say way war, many, many are going in the grave, they are smoking, sleeping, they blow dead bodies over the city. They're not supposed to do that. Yeah. All right, so what would you like to see happening for the youth of Liberia? I'd like to see the youth of Liberia working, working hard to make it in life, not to depend on their friend's pocket. Yeah, and not to be liberated on others. Yeah, me, I'd like to be liberated on others. I'd like to be myself. Strong. Yeah, I'd like for my friends to be. <laughs> Hello, my name is Chimba Dondada. Welcome to Talk Liberia. My name is Zeze Araflomo Jr. Okay, Zeze, welcome. We want to know, do you think Liberia actually belongs to Liberia? No, Liberia is not belonging to Liberia. Why say so? Because businesses and other things are owned by foreigners. So because of that, Liberia is not for Liberia. All right, all right, tell me, how do you feel about the situation in Liberia where majority of the BB businesses are owned by foreigners and Liberians are selling with our market? It's also pathetic to see businesses that we Liberians can venture into. We are into it. We allow foreigners to come and do business here. So as such, we get affected majority of the time. So it sounds so bad. I feel so bad about the situation. All right. 
tell me, do you think Labrador is so poor that she cannot provide for her citizen? No, get this right. Labrador isn't poor. Our mind is poor. Ha! <laughs> Labrador is rich. We have a lot of minerals, you know. But our mind isn't developed. So because our mind isn't developed, people come here and then they take our mineral, use us to get our own mineral from us. So Labrador isn't poor to feed a citizen, but Labrador have not developed a citizen mind. So because of that, she, she is not capable enough to feed her citizens. All right. So why do you think Liberians are suffering in your own country? Because we don't want to work. We don't want to venture into businesses. And I can tell anybody for free, any successful may want to be successful, venture into business. But we don't want to work. We don't want to do anything. We got a theory in Liberia where we only want to say that our country is here. We can't, we can't be deported. So because we feel that we can't be deported, so we don't want to work. We want to venture into anything. We just want to sit and see it come easy. All right. People always say the youth of Liberia are lazy. Is that really true? 100%, it is true. 100%. 100%. The youth of Liberia, they are very, very lazy. What do you mean by that? Go and ask your grandfather. Right. So tell me, what would you like to see happening for the youth of Liberia? Okay. In the next five years, as an ethical leader, I, I foresee that in the next five years, these very youth who don't want to be serious, we are the one to take mantle of authority, right? Some of us are going to be president. Look like, like I'm looking now. I'm looking like the next president of Liberia. But in the next five years, I want to see the youth of Liberia owning Liberia, venturing into businesses, having a lot of things that will improve the growth of our country. Good job, My name is Jamel Dondada. Welcome to Talk Liberia. My name is Amos Arasiava. All right, Amos, we want to know, do you think Liberia actually belongs to Liberian? Yes, Liberia is actually belongs to Liberians. Liberia actually belongs to Liberians? Sure. All right, so tell me, how do you feel about the situation in Liberia where all the big businesses are owned by foreigners and Liberians are selling without market? I feel so bad, but not in the And also, I pray that the government increase more jobs for the citizens. Because there is no job for the citizens. The reason why we see Many librarians selling the street, doing all other things. And I send this out to the government to please provide more jobs for the citizens. All right. Do you think Liberia is poor to the extent that she cannot provide for her citizens? No. The reason being, we are not faithful to our own selves. This is the reason why Liberia will always look like we are poor. All right. So some people say the youth of Liberia are lazy. Is that really true? The youth are not very really lazy. The reason being, no job. That's the reason why God moved youth all around the street doing other things that will not please us. Okay. Why you think Liberians are serving their own country? Why? Liberians are serving because they are. So many corrupt people in this country. Most likely our minister, Rabbi Senedi, they all with letter death for them to help us. But they are in the house stealing from us. They don't like us. And the reason why you see more librarians are suffering. Uh, all right, so, so tell me, what would you like to see happening for the youth in the next five years to come? I would, I would like to see transparent for us, our, for us. Yes. I want to see good educations set up within Liberia, jobs taken, say in Liberia, as well as health facilities. All right. My name is Jamel Dondada. We're going to talk Liberia. And let me say happy July 26th to you. My name thank is Jamel Dondada. We're going to talk Liberia. Okay, thank you. Uh, we want to know. 
Do you think Liberia is actually for Liberian? Yes, Liberia is for Liberian. Yes. Liberia is actually for Liberian. Yes. Yes. Uh, okay, how do you feel about the situation in Liberia where majority of the big businesses are owned by foreigners and Liberians are doing well up market? Listen, listen. <laughs> um, in my own, my own field, yeah, I think the librarians, that's why the, that, that's why they believe in selling with a market and with the full of people to believe in our business too. Yeah. You are dreaming. So you say librarian believe in what? With a market. <laughs> librarian believe in selling with a market. Yeah, with a market. All the courses, I feel like they like to sell. Maybe all right. All the challenges of selling big store, like full of bread, all the full of, full of stuff, I want to think on. All right, do you think Liberia is poor to the extent that she cannot afford for her citizen? Liberia is not poor to the extent that she can't afford for her citizen. No. Liberia can't afford for her citizen because uh, the rest, the country rest who is doing those things, that it come already in the same country. Pepper, the job, the pepper, we can eat the fresh pepper, the pillar boss. So now our citizen provide this. Yeah. All right. Tell so tell me, why do you think Liberians are suffering in your own country? I'm suffering in our own country. As for me, I'm not suffering, so I don't know about others. Yeah. Oh, you are not suffering? Yeah, I don't know about others. All right. So tell me, some people say the youth of Liberia are very lazy. Is that really true? Uh, the youth of Liberia. Yes, I can say yes, it's true. <laughs> Mm, I swear to God, you will be hospitalized. Because most of the time, everybody wants to live in the city. And most youth, they start sporting themselves, doing a lot of gambling. See, mother, you have that only minds or you know, chase, they're not chasing the money, but chasing it the, the negative way. Yeah, they want to get it the negative. Some are stealing, some are doing a lot of social work, some are smoking the drugs, go out there and do a lot of things. But they don't want to focus on mind or getting, their, getting money the positive way. Yeah, by working hard for it to earn it. Something that the youth are lazy. Yeah, they are very lazy. All right. So, what you what would you like to see happening in the life of the youth of Liberia? Well, what I like to see happening, I want to see everybody focus, everybody working hard for the call to come truth. Because Mama Liberia is our only country, the only country our neighbors can spare. We can now be put there from this country. Yes, so we all need to work and cooperate with each other to make life a better one for tomorrow. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. Shit, I'm sorry. All right, it was nice having you on Talk Liberia. Follow her on Facebook, follow her on Instagram. Let me say happy Independence Day to you. Hello? Yeah, hello. My name is Chamber Dondada. Welcome to Talk Liberia. Yeah, my name is Wisa. All right, Wisa, welcome. Do you think Liberia are charter for Liberians? Of course, the library, the library of a librarian. Are you ready to show up? For sure. Okay, so how do you feel about the situation in Liberia where majority of the big businesses are owned by foreigners and Liberians are selling with a market? I don't feel happy. Because again, we don't allow all the people come take over the country. Then we are selling, selling with a market. I don't feel happy. Yes. Okay, do you think Liberia is poor to the extent that she cannot provide for her citizen? No, Liberia is not poor country. Liberia is the richest country in Africa, and Liberia is, is able to provide for the citizen. Yes. So why do you think Liberians are suffering in their own country? Because we, our, our, our government provides jobs for the, for the, for the Liberian. So we uh, use our method to look for a lot of money. Yeah, that's it. All right. Some people say the youth of Liberia are lazy. Is that really true? The little and lazy, you know, have no job in the country, but you are not lazy. So, what would you like to see happening for the youth of this country? Actually, I don't see the youth going on like selling for themselves, the health centers, business schools, and all other materials that like, we see in the country. All right. It was nice to have you on Talk Liberia. I'm Jamie Dondada. Let me say happy July 26th. All right. Same to you. Thank you. Eventually.
Nobody is not there again. Eventually. <laughs>